What's good, people? It's your boy, Billy Mac. We are here. We are here once again. Another mycology for you. This one is about jealous men. I I can't stand jealous men. And, and it pains me that these women still continue to entertain these dudes. Now, I ain't gonna, I, I, ain't, I ain't hating. I ain't hating. But what I think the issue is, is a lot of women are taking his jealousy as a form of love and protection. No. 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 Ladies, if a man is jealous, okay, oh, first of all, let me, let me just put this out there, okay? I'm going to put this out there. Um, there's only... I'm, I'm going to put it to you like this. I, I, know, I know in one of my other videos, I can't remember which one, but I know I said this in one of my other videos. Ladies, when you get married to a man, I want you to understand, his eyes wander. He's still going to be looking at other women. It, it just... It is what it is. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter how faithful he is. And I, I'm telling you, man, I'm faithful. To me, I, 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 listen, humble brag, I think I'm the cream of the crop. You know, I'm the creme de la creme de la creme of, of faithfulness. You know what I'm saying? But I think a lot of men, what a lot of women need to understand is, you, your man is going to look. He's always going to look, Okay. But here's the part about jealous dudes that I don't understand. They have this sense of entitlement. She can't she can't look at other men, but but I can I can I can look at other women. She can't cheat on me, but I can. You know, it, I don't I don't understand that. I don't understand why dudes why dudes do that. I, I don't get it. It's like, bro, nine times out of ten, when you date a female, nine times out of ten, when you date a female, other men want the same female you want. It just, it just is what it is. And and I I guess I understood this as a young dude because there was this one girl in high school I tried to get with. And this one dude kept blocking, and 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 the thing maybe the thing was I don't I, actually I don't know what the thing was, but dude kept blocking. Now I was the type of dude I don't, like I said I don't believe I, you know I have a temper, but I I, I try to be nonviolent. I try to be you know calm and collective about certain things. So basically. Me and this chick didn't get together simply because I didn't fight for her honor. My thing is this. Ma'am, um, just because... First of all, uh, <laughs> lady, if, if, if you want to be with me, then be with me. I'm not going to fight tooth and nail for you. I'm just not. You, cause you have to show me that you want to be with me too, you know. Just like I had to show you I want to be with you, you gotta show me you want to be with me, you know. Ultimately, now granted, when we get married, that fifty-fifty stuff goes out the window. Clearly, clearly it goes out the window. But we just—I'm just trying to make you my girlfriend. You know what I mean? I am not trying. I'm not trying to fight for your honor just to be my girlfriend. So, it's like, yeah, I knew what I had to do, but a lot, but at the same time, it's like, no, <laughs> no, this Negro, this Negro is literally entertaining you just to entertain you. He don't really want to be with you. I want to be with you, but the reason you entertaining him is so, I guess, to make me fight for your love or whatever, man, please, man, throw that trash away. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, I ain't got time for that, man. So, 
I say all of this to get to, I guess, my point. Ladies, if you're dating a jealous man, please understand. He, it's not because he loves you. It's not. It's not. It's not. I have yet to see a situation where a woman has been with a jealous man and it's simply because, man, I just, I just love her so much, man. I just, I just don't want anything to happen to her. No, that doesn't even make sense. You can be protective of your woman, but you ain't got to be a jealous nigga. You understand what I'm saying? Like, this, like, bruh, I understand my wife. I understand you might find my wife attractive. You might even, you might even disrespect me. And try to run some game on her. The ultimate form of trust is knowing that I can allow any nigga to talk to my wife. And she ain't going to do nothing. If you are a female. And any nigga can talk to you. And make you change your mind about your current situation. You ain't even ready for You ain't ready to be married. You are ready, you're not ready for a committed relationship. And I've met women like this. They get mad. In fact, side chick mentality. That's side chick mentality. You, you, so, so you'll entertain flirting and talking to another man. You might actually, it, or I should say this. Entertaining it, listening to it is fine. But when you go forward with it, no, nah, man, come on, come on. But then you swear, but I want to be married. I want to be in a committed marriage. Uh, these niggas out here ain't, you know, they ain't doing nothing. Well, if, <laughs> the reason, listen, listen, listen. I'm, I'm, this is the truest statement I will say on this page, and I promise you. Men are only going to treat you the way they know other men have treated you. And that's the truth. If you're the type of woman that allows niggas to just run through you and and, and let it go, guess what niggas are going to do? Keep running through you and let it go. Because we communicate with each other. We ask each other. We talk to each other. Hey, bro, I see you all. Uh, Hey, bro, um, I see you dating uh, such and such. You know, I heard I heard all you got to do is buy her dinner, man. She's going to give it up. Dumb ladies, those are the conversations we have. Those are the conversations we have, ladies. Whether you like it or not, that's what we talking to each other about. Hey, bro. Hey, bro, I heard you dated. What's her name? You know, I'm talking to her right now. Let me know. What, what, what's the scoop on her? Hey, bro, you know, I mean, she a good girl. She kind of crazy, though. What? She crazy? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. She got mad at me. She got mad at me because I was talking to my best friend who's a female. What do you mean? Oh, I was, we was just talking. We were kicking it, hitting it up with each other. And she, their homegirl lost her mind. Wait, what? That, yeah, man. Don't. I mean, she cool, but don't let her, don't let her catch you. Just conversing with other females, man. Don't don't even let her catch you doing that. See, nah. Then we gonna drop you. We gonna drop you. Ladies, that's how we roll. We talk to each other. <laughs> we talk to each other. You know what I mean? That's that's how it is. That's how it is. So this whole thing with jealous niggas. I don't understand because you know, I was listening to a Breakfast Club interview and this one girl, she was talking about how she had to get out of a relationship because dude was jealous. Dude was, you know, very jealous. And she admitted, she's like, I thought his jealousy was because he really liked me. He really cared for me. And, and he wanted to just protect me and this, that, and the other. Ladies, let's use some common sense. Unlike R. Kelly. Let's, let's, let's use some real common sense, ladies. If a guy does not want you to go hang out with your friends, he is a jealous dude. He That ain't about love. He's jealous. 
if a dude does not want you to have any other male friends, he is a jealous dude. He does not love you. He is a jealous dude. If he if he literally wonders where you've gone, where you've been, where you coming from all the time, even when it's just work, baby, I'm at work. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So you 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 you, you ain't work. Like you, you you ain't nowhere else though. So if I come to your job right now, you gonna beat it. That's not love. That's jealousy. And more importantly, that's insecurity. Ladies, I wish I could pinpoint what a jealous man is. The attributes you should look for. But the fact of the matter is, if he doesn't allow you to live your life, there's a jealousy complex in there somewhere. And you might need to consider letting this Negro go. I'm just saying. There's a jealousy complex in there somewhere. And you might need to consider letting this Negro go. Because obviously he, um, he, he doesn't get it. <laughs> he doesn't get it. You know, he, he, he don't get it. He obviously don't get it, man. I tell you, man, this is uh, an insecure man is one of the worst things in the world. An insecure man is one of the worst things in the world. I'm trying to think, was I ever insecure? I was insecure about simple things, but not my woman. I'd always I always told myself I ain't never going to I ain't never going to be. I, I just don't want to be a jealous dude. First of all. I think one of the main reasons that my parents and other black families in general allowed their children to watch what love's got to do with it was to show was to show you how not to be Ike Turner. That's the one thing I got from that movie. I I'm I told myself, you know what, I ain't ever gonna I'm not gonna be an Ike Turner when I grow up. You know what I'm saying? For you know, I just I'm not gonna be Ike Turner when I grow up. That that's what I took from that movie. I mean, that's one of the things I took from that movie. But ultimately that's what I took from that movie. I'm not gonna be Ike Turner. I am not going to be Ike Turner. You understand what I'm saying? I don't. I don't know why. I don't know why these these jealous dudes, these insecure dudes, man. And, and then it be the dudes that have no reason to be insecure. They got money. They, you know, they they got a physique on them. They strong. Go to the gym all the time. And you insecure, like bruh, like, bruh. Why you? What you insecure for, man? What you insecure for? Why? You know? That's how it is, man. That's how it is. I don't, I don't understand. I wish somebody could explain it to me. I don't, I don't like insecure Negroes. But there's a reason that we as men get insecure about our woman. But that's for another video. The moral of this story is, ladies, ladies, stop dating jealous men. I have yet to see a relationship. I have yet to see a relationship. And I've seen plenty of them, a lot of them, actually. I've yet to see a relationship that turned out well and the dude was a, a jealous a-hole. It's a lot of them. They haven't turned out well. So if you find yourself in a relationship with a jealous man, ladies understand, there's a di there's a level, there's a difference between protecting your woman and being flat out jealous. There's a difference. There's a difference. And hopefully, hopefully I can do some research or I can get in some deep thought and I can help you see the difference 
between both. But until next time, please like, subscribe, share, comment. Please comment. Let me know. Let me know how I'm doing. It's your boy, Billy Mac. Shout out to my wife, my daughter, family and friends, everybody I know and love. Shout out to y'all. Thank y'all for supporting your boy. It's your boy, Billy Mac. Peace.